Hey guys, Anissa here, and we are gonna play in a wig today, which is the one that I'm wearing. So if you like wigs, if you found my channel, thanks to my other wig videos, make sure you're subscribed and that you hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on anything and like this video. So into this unit that I'm wearing, it is so different from what I'm used to wearing. Um, first and foremost, thank you to Zuri Sis for sending this out for me to try on for you guys and give you just a little show and tell um, my thoughts about it and the specs so you can see it in action. Um, for me, especially because I'm used to longer units, for me, shorter ones are always something completely different, but that's why I love wigs because you can change up your look without like changing your own hair, you know? So very easy, very versatile. The style that I'm wearing today is the Solly. It is from the Beyond Your Imagination collection. And the color that I'm wearing is FS1B slash 30. So it's really like a 1B base and it has a couple of highlights in it, which is, this is like one of my favorite combinations ever in wigs. So if you're ever like, I don't want a completely black wig, I don't want all brown, this is like so, 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 so perfect. Um, this one is a synthetic unit. I'm gonna look up the price right now for the link that I'm gonna put down in the description code. So, description box. Yeah, you know. So it looks like this one is $27.99 on Elevate Style. So I'll have that link down below so you can grab it. So right underneath $30 synthetic. Um, it is heat safe up to 400 degrees. It is just your standard lace from ear to ear and just one part option. Now this one is like a little bit of a curved part. It goes pretty deep. I did add concealer and everything. I'm gonna insert some clips of how I styled it right now just so you can see what I did. I did have to pull out my baby hairs because of the pure fact that this one does not have baby hairs included, which I actually don't mind. Sometimes the baby hairs on units can just be a little wonky. So I can blend my own. If you have relaxed hair, you don't mind straightening your hair, you could probably actually wear your hairline out on this unit and blend it into it um, and go from there. Now for this parting, I didn't pluck it at all. It is a hand tied part. I just added some concealer to it just to define it out just a teach more. I did forget to mention the different colors that is available in this unit. Um, obviously the one that I'm wearing is the FS 1B slash 30, but you can get it in 1, 1B, 99J2, some RT 2730s, some RT burgundy. So you have quite a few options when it comes to color. Um, you can experiment a little bit with this. I did wish there was a lighter blonde mix, like something with a 613 mixed into it just to get like that real great like dimension to it, like that platinum blonde fun. Um, but like I said, this color is one of my go-tos in any style. Now this unit has a lot of body, even though it's shorter. As you can see, there's a lot of layers to it. I really just, with this, I like to hand tease it because if not, I feel like it can fit pretty flat. But once you tease it and get some dimension to it and have that movement showing in this unit, it just brings it to a whole new level. Now the hair fibers on this synthetic unit I really like, like the luster as you can see is really nice. It's not too shiny. It just really looks like healthy hair that was pressed and styled and cut perfectly. Now I'll talk about the fit in the wig cap construction. I'm not gonna do a whole show and tell of that because it really is just your standard cap construction where you have combs on the side, one comb in the back, and then your adjustable bands to make it tighter. I actually think, if I'm not mistaken, I can feel under here. I have it on the loosest setting on one side and undone on the other because for me, this is a pretty snug fit. I have a pretty large head. I think, if I'm not mistaken, a 23 inch circumference around, but this is a exact snug fit. If my head was bigger, it really honestly, maybe a little bit of a struggle. Another thing to talk about with this unit is of course, tangling and shedding. That is always like our number one question as wig lovers, like does she shed and does she tangle? Now as for shedding, only a little bit, very, very little, um, what I normally expect when I'm first wearing a unit, a couple of strands here or there. As for tangling, I don't foresee it being an issue with this unit just because it is shorter. A lot of times your longer units, especially with synthetics, you experience more tangling with versus shorter units. 
So you guys, that wraps up today's wig fun. I am going to insert clips just of me wearing the unit so you can see it in motion without me yapping about it. Um, if you have any other questions about this unit, let me know in the comment box down below. I'd love to hear from you all. I try to get back to you all as soon as possible. And then don't forget to check out the description box for the purchase link so you can enjoy the Sally because I think she's really fun, especially if you're like me and you want something a little bit different. You want to play around with short hair, but you don't want to sacrifice body because if you've been around on my channel for a while, you know I like big hair. Like I like body wave. I like it all. But this was a really fun switch up. Thank you again to Zori for sending me this unit. I will catch you all in my next video, but only if you hit subscribe and the bell notifications so you know when I upload. Um, check out these clips and I will see you in my next video.